Wimbledon 2003, French Open 2009 and two Cincinnati triumphs are among the Swiss Maestro's most important wins Number 1 Milan 2001, Federer's first tournament triumph came in Italy at the age of 19. He beat Goran Ivanisvic and Evgeny Kafelnikov on his way to the final in Italy where he overcame Frenchman Julian Bowder in a tense three-set match 6-4, 6-7, 6-4. AP Photo number 3 Hamburg 2002. This success in May 2002 was significant for a couple of reasons. It was a Masters title but also the first time he had prevailed on clay. Merritt's often was beaten in the final on this occasion, the score 6-1, 6-3, 6-4. Getty number 6 Dubai 2003, Federer had not exactly covered himself in glory in Dubai the year before by being accused of tanking by organizers in his defeat to Rainer Shetler. But that was all forgotten this time around as he won a tournament he would go on to win a further seven times. He did not drop a set in five matches as he beat Yuri Novak in the final to lift the trophy. AFP number 9 Wimbledon 2003, Federer first Grand Slam title came on the grass of Wimbledon. Federer only lost one set on his way to becoming champion, and his demolition of pre-tournament favorite Andy Roddick in the semi-finals remains one of his best performances at the venue. Getty No. 12 Australian Open 2004, a first major in Melbourne and Federer's first as world No. 1. He had not been beyond the fourth round previously but he cruised to the title here, defeating Safin in the final. Getty No. 20 US Open 2004, the start of five years of domination in New York as the Swiss picked up his first title at Flushing Meadows. He suffered a scare in the quarterfinals as he was taken to five sets by Andre Agassi, but otherwise, he was impervious as he beat Leighton Hewitt 6-0, 7-6, 6-0 in the final. NY Daily News Archive via Getty Images, number 50 Cincinnati, 2007 The half-century of titles came in August 2007 at the Cincinnati Masters. American James Blake was the man beaten in the final this time, 6-1, 6-4. Getty No. 59 French Open 2009, Federer finally completed his career Grand Slam as he won in Paris. The Roland Garros title had long eluded Federer, largely because of Rafael Nadal who three times had beaten him in the final. But Federer was the victor in 2009 as Robin Soderling was beaten in straight sets in the final. Getty No. 87 Cincinnati, 2015, major titles had proven somewhat tougher to win since 2010 with the rise of Novak Djokovic. But Federer proved he could be a match for the Serbian on his day as he claimed an emphatic 6-1, 7-5 triumph at the Masters event. Getty No. 89 Australian Open, 2017, Federer had not won a major since 2012 and there had been many doubters that he would add to his 17 but he proved them wrong with a stunning to display in Melbourne. In his first tournament since timeout after knee surgery, he beat Nadal in a five-setter thriller in the final to claim that elusive 18th major. Getty No. 97 Rotterdam, 2018, on the surface of it this success here, by his standards, was largely unremarkable as he cruised past Grigor Dimitrov for the loss of just four games in the final. but competing in the Netherlands allowed him to become world number one again at the age of 36. Reuters number 100 Dubai, 2019. The milestone title came at one of his happiest hunting grounds as he picked up his eighth crown at the Dubai Duty Free Tennis Stadium. After a slow start to the week he was superb in beating Borna George and Stefanos Tsitsipas respectively in the semi-finals and final. Getty